Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It is Vlogmas Day 22, 23, I don't know at this point, but today has been a crazy emotional day. I had a whole clip that I filmed earlier and I was gonna make that my entire video, but it's a lot. I basically went at it and vented and said a lot of stuff and I don't know if people are, um, I don't even know how to explain it. Oh no, if people are able to handle that side of me because there are some negative people who might say something or think something and I just decided I wasn't going to make that my video. Yeah, today's been a day. Michael's feeling it too. It's just been super emotional. There's a lot going on between me and my mom and the holidays are just really stressful time this year and we've all been feeling it. My mom's stressed. It's reflecting on every member of this family and I'm stressed. And it's, you know, backlashing on everyone else who's also stressed out. And there's a lot. There's a lot going on. I said in my clip before that I haven't inserted that I just want this holiday to be over. And that's true. It's not been feeling like Christmas this year. As I've gotten older, Christmas has just not really felt um, right. It's not like how things were when I was little. I don't feel an excitement, and I know I should because for Michael, but I don't. And I'm gonna try as hard as I can to put on a smile for Michael so he can get through this holiday, but I truly am at the point where I don't want to open presents. I don't want to do anything and my mom is feeling the same. Again, we have said some things to each other that aren't so very nice. It's quite hurtful. My mom has said quite a lot of things in my life that have really been hurtful and a lot of them have stuck and it causes a lot of, what's the word? A lot of issues um, in my life long term. And I have a lot I need to work on with myself. I have just had a horrific day with packages, with USPS and Canada Post have just haven't been good. I was supposed to get my Jeffree Star mystery boxes today and they said they tried to ship them to the house and I was here. I was waiting for them, and no knock on the door, no doorbell ring, and they left without leaving my packages at the door. Which is weird because USPS always leaves packages at the door, so that's a little weird. The excitement of the boxes have just died. I already know everything that could be in my box, so the mystery of it is ruined because it's been so long and people have been getting their boxes since the beginning of the month. Oh, and plus, if you saw the last video, Boxy, a uh, Boxy, a charm, they sent the wrong items in my box, my choice items, so that was also screwed up. So it's like I can't win. It's like everything is just going completely wrong. I bought Ugg boots and they sent me the wrong Uggs. They were supposed to send me the ones that had like the laces on it and looked like um, Ugg sneakers, but I didn't get those. Instead, they sent me the short Uggs. There was another, I mean, the ones they sent me were the other pair that I would have bought, but I didn't because it was a little more pricey. And so, I ended up just getting another pair and I'm not even gonna bother to contact them or try to exchange it because one, there is no return slip or any of that in my uh, package and there's no way that I'd be able to go through all that to even like 
box it up, take it. Like, I rely on my mom to drive me places because I don't have a car and my license yet. I still have my learners. I've also been feeling kind of down with my YouTube channel because people don't realize how much hard work it really takes to put up a video every single day for the whole month. For me specifically, I film and then I have to edit when Michael is taking his nap or when he's sleeping. If I do all of it when he's sleeping, then the video doesn't upload at night some nights because my Wi-Fi is so slow and I don't know why because we have the highest most expensive uh, Wi-Fi. It takes sometimes three hours and then some nights it's so slow and if I don't have the computer all the way open and using it, it doesn't load. Like I can't just plug it in and let it sit there like overnight to do it because it won't load. And on top of all that, I have to make the thumbnail and that takes a while. It's a lot of work. And not seeing the progress that I was hoping to get from filming every day is really just discouraging me. Like I'm not gaining subscribers, I'm not getting the views I wanted, and it just it sucks. Like I watch all these other YouTube channels, family channels that I love, and they're thriving and doing so well, and they're living out my dream by making this their full-time job and doing what they love, because I love filming, I love posting, but I don't see the response that I want, which makes me feel like people aren't interested in our videos. Um, people aren't commenting, uh, so I don't know if they're enjoying it or liking it, and when I don't see feedback from our channel and our videos, it just makes me feel like I'm doing this for what? because I want to inspire people. I want to show people my real life and show them that, hey, not everything is all sunshine and daisies every day. You have those days where I'm really emotional and upset and I struggle. I, being a single mom, it's tough. And I feel for each and every single one of you out there, no matter how old you are or how many kids you have, if you're a single mom or dad doing it on your own, I commend you so much because it's a lot. I've accepted the fact of Michael's dad not being a part of his life, but there are days when it does creep up on me and upset me because he is the most happiest, loving boy in the entire world and I don't understand how someone would not want to be a part of his life and watch him grow. I just, I could never understand that. And it upsets me because he doesn't deserve that. I was like really upset. So I think we're gonna end the video here. Hope you guys enjoyed uh, listening to my little rant and maybe we'll see you tomorrow. I'm not too sure, most likely. But thank you for watching. We love you so much. And yeah. Bye.